Researchers in Singapore have discovered an earthquake that rumbled on for more than three decades. The slow-motion tremor eventually led to the catastrophic 1861 Sumatra earthquake. Uh, the team from the Nanyang Technological University found that the quake went on for 32 years without triggering disastrous tremors and tsunamis. They made the surprise discovery while studying historic sea levels off the coast of Sumatra. This information can be used to improve earthquake and tsunami forecasting. This really long drawn out slip episode finally led to this huge earthquake in 1861. So there's a sort of correlation between something that goes on for a long time is slow and we have detected it leading to something which is really damaging. What we've kind of uncovered is really related to the physics of how these tectonic faults work, right? Like uh, these slow slip events are one mode in which these faults work. They also work as earthquakes and they also could maybe do nothing. Once you get to the physics of how these faults work, that can be used to develop better models of how faults will slip in earthquakes or more damaging events. So if you want to think about forecasting hazards, you want to really get to the core underlying principles of how these faults work. And what our study has done is highlight that there's this unknown and like really long-lived mode that we had been ignoring till now, or rather we didn't know about it till now.